Today you will learn how to talk about weekdays and how to say things like I work from Monday to Friday or I cannot wait for Saturday to come. Let's start with the basics and talking about names for each weekday. In Russian we have понедельник for Monday, понедельник, then we have вторник, вторник for Tuesday, среда for Wednesday, четверг for Thursday, пятница for Friday, суббота for Saturday, and воскресенье for Sunday. Let's go over them again and talk about their pronunciation rules or uniqueness of each. Понедельник, long word, but we say понедельник, понедельник. Even though you see it, it's spelled as понедельник, the first letter is O, the first vowel is O, but we say it as понедельник. Because it's not stressed, it's going to sound like A. Понедельник. Then we have вторник. The first letter is V, but we read it as F, like an F. Вторник. Вторник. It's always, almost always that the first letter, if it's V in the Russian word, it will sound like F, because it's just easier to pronounce. Вторник. Then we have среда. Среда for Wednesday. Again, we have Е as a vowel. It should be sounding like среда, right? But because it's not stressed, again, Е is going to sound like И. Среда. Среда. Similar is going to happen with четверг. We have Ч and Е. So Е is the vowel, but we pronounce it as четверг. 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 Then we have пятница. 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 Суббота. Суббота. Even though we have double B, суббота, we pronounce it as just simply as if it's one B. Суббота. Суббота. And once again, воскресенье, long word, воскресенье. Воскресенье. Now that you know how to pronounce them properly, let's talk about one thing about each of those words that will make it easier to remember for the future. One unique thing about понедельник is that the stem is недель. Неделя in Russian means a week. And we start our week with a Monday. So понедельник, Monday is like a week starter. Okay? Next is вторник. Вторник is similar to in Russian второй, which means second. Второй and Tuesday is the second day of the week. So вторник is like a second day. Вторник, Tuesday, second day. Then we have среда, Wednesday. Среда sounds similar to in Russian середина. Середина means middle, okay? And Wednesday is kind of like in the middle of the week. So среда is going to be in the middle. Среда means Wednesday. Then we have четверг, Thursday. Четверг, in Russian, we have четвертый, which means fourth. Четвертый, четверг sounds very, very similar. So четверг is like a fourth day of the week, Thursday. Similar to пятница. Пятница is Friday. And in Russian, пятый means fifth. So Friday is like a fifth day of the week, similar logic to вторник and четверг. Пятница is Friday. Then we have суббота. Суббота sounds very similar to Sabbath. And in fact, Sabbath is on a Saturday and суббота is Saturday as well. So think of суббота, Sabbath and Saturday. And lastly, we have воскресенье. Воскресенье literally means resurrection. And Jesus Christ resurrected on Sunday, so that's the one thing to remember this with. Воскресенье means Sunday and also means resurrection. I don't mean for this video to be religious or anything, but religion did play a big part in the Russian culture a long time ago when the language was just simply forming, and so it kind of carried over to today's day as well. Next, let's talk about how to properly use weekdays in a sentence. We need to attach a few prepositions to them to say things like on Monday, from Monday to Saturday, and things like that. The most common one to add before a weekday in Russian is V, which means on or in. If I say в понедельник, that means on Monday. So let's uh, give a, a few examples. Я работаю в понедельник. I work on Monday. We have в понедельник, it kind of means in Monday, I work in Monday, but of course in English we say on Monday. So V is used to talk about a specific weekday when you do something. I can also say в субботу и воскресенье я отдыхаю. On Saturday and Sunday I rest. 
Okay, so as you can see, we use V just once here. V subotu i vaskresenia means on Saturday and Sunday. All right? I can also say Prihadi ko mne v gosti v četvrk. Come visit me on a Thursday. Okay? V četvrk means on a Thursday. But for us to use this V plus weekday in Russian, we have to know forms of weekdays and how they change, how they change their ending. Let's bring back the list of all weekdays right here. Look at this list. All the words or all the weekday words that end on A, when we add V, their ending will change to U. As you can see right here, they changed into U whenever we added V. Meanwhile, all the rest stayed the same. So, в понедельник, во вторник, we'll talk about this one in a second, в среду, в четверг, в пятницу, в субботу, and в воскресенье. There's two things to notice here. Number one is, why do we have to use в with вторник? Why can't we just use в like with all the rest? We have to use в because it would have to be super hard to pronounce вторник, right? Like вторник is very, very unnatural to pronounce. So we have to kind of add an extra vowel there so it's not going to be too much of a tongue twister. Во вторник is much easier to pronounce than just вторник, right? Or вторник. It's kind of unnatural. So we have to separate the two words with an extra vowel. Во вторник. And secondly, you kind of heard me pronounce the first one, for example, в понедельник. I don't pronounce it as в понедельник. It kind of all comes together. В понедельник. And в sounds like F. В понедельник. I don't say в понедельник. It's much more simple. В понедельник. Во вторник. That one's an exception. But в среду. Again, в среду. В четверг. В пятницу. В субботу. And в воскресенье. Now, в воскресенье is the only exception. Because we have two v's. It's hard to pronounce F воскресенье because that's two different sounds. And this phenomenon where we have to change the endings is called cases. If you're familiar with cases, then this is accusative case. If you're not familiar, it's okay. You will get to it in time. Don't rush it. It's too much information for today. But now let's talk about another usage, another use case of weekdays. Then if you want to talk about things that happen regularly on a certain weekday, each and every single week, use по. По before any weekday. I can say, я не работаю по средам. I don't work on Wednesdays. Each and every single week, I don't work on Wednesdays. Then more of a schedule example, we can say, мусор забирают по четвергам. The trash gets picked up on Thursdays. So, по четвергам means on Thursdays. But once again, we have to change the endings, but this time we have to use plurals like Mondays, Tuesdays, Wednesdays. Let's talk about that and let's learn those forms as well. По понедельникам, по вторникам, по средам, по четвергам, по пятницам, по субботам, and по воскресеньям. So we add am or yam typically with the with the weekdays. And another thing to notice here is that I don't say по понедельникам, по вторникам. I say по понедельникам, по вторникам, по средам. We say по, even though it's spelled as о, we say по. Because whenever we have a preposition attached to a word, it's almost like one big word. And о in a preposition is most likely not going to be stressed. So о will sound like а. По понедельникам, по вторникам, etc. But then, what if you want to talk about a period of time? From Monday to Friday. We can say it like this. С понедельника по пятницу. From Monday to Friday. As you can see, we have с and по. We have to use those two prepositions as a pair with this kind of phrase. And actually, I can give you an example about our b fluent camp. I can say с понедельника по пятницу мы учим русский. С понедельника means from Monday. По пятницу means until Friday or from Monday to Friday. Мы учим русский, we learn Russian. And that's true, from Monday to Friday, we give you guys tasks for you to work on, and we actually do learn a lot. And you can join our B-Fluent Camp with the first link in the bio, and you will also learn a lot as well. Moving on, 
Maybe another example can be С четверга по воскресенье я не работаю. С четверга по воскресенье From Thursday to Sunday я не работаю. I don't work. Maybe you're one of those lucky people who doesn't work for the majority of the week and I envy you. But again, forms will change of each weekday. Let's talk about that next. This time we're going to have two different forms for two different prepositions. Let's start with с. С понедельника, со вторника, со среды, с четверга, с пятницы, с субботы and с воскресенья. Okay, so from Monday, from Tuesday, from Wednesday, etc. We have two different variations this time. Again, we have с for the first and the last ones. And we have со for с вторника and с среды. The reason why we have so again is to create that space so we won't have to cram so many consonants in a row. It's hard to say с вторника, right? С вторника, it's kind of hard to say, similar with среды, right? We have to add that extra vowel there, с вторника, с среды, so it can be a bit easier to pronounce. But notice that for all others that just have one letter с, I kind of say them in a row. С понедельника. I don't take a pause. I, I don't say с понедельника or с понедельника. It's с понедельника, с четверга, с пятницы. It kind of just all flows together. And now on to по. По понедельник, по вторник, по среду, по четверг, по пятницу, по субботу, and по воскресенье. Notice that I say pa, okay? Not po, but pa. Because once again, we kind of read them as one word, and o will sound like a whenever it's not stressed. So I read pa понедельник, pa вторник, etc. And a few phrases with weekdays that you can commonly hear people say. I can say, поскорее бы уже пятница. I cannot wait for Friday. I wish Friday would happen sooner. Поскорее бы уже Пятница. Then I can say, ненавижу понедельник. I hate Monday. Ненавижу понедельник. Ненавижу means I hate. Понедельник means Monday. We don't really have a phrase for thank God it's Friday in Russian, but I guess I can translate it more literally and say, слава Богу, что сегодня пятница. To say, see you on Wednesday, I can say, увидимся в среду. See you, увидимся, we'll see each other. В среду means on a Wednesday. Or we can just simply say it shorter and say до среды, until Wednesday. And that's all the phrases, guys. If you want to take your Russian to the next level, join our BFluent camp with this button right here. You will learn a whole lot.